Hello and welcome back to The Broken Doll. And today I'm coming to you with these legs. Well, I should say tonight I'm coming. It's actually five to, to one. So anyhow, here we are out in the shop and we're going to take a look at these legs. Now, I wasn't too happy with what I was seeing. I mean, the results are pretty good, but not as good as what I got from the arms. I have put in more, um, about another four, uh, tablets in here another four in here I've been keeping them the same but and they have the same time on there but it's not improving as much as I would like to see it's lightened up a little bit this was really dark dark but still dark as far as I'm concerned it just isn't lightening up enough you know um might have to do the pimp pimple cream solution on it I sometimes you're only going to get what you want like this is beautiful it's starting to show some results but still very dark there the foot's still very dark but we're going to let it keep going you know we're going to let it keep going and um we still got some you can see around the ankle here it's just um all around up here in the higher thigh of the of the doll the back of the leg of the doll we might just have to do the pimple cream on it just put a massive amount wrap it up and just let it, the hair dryer try doing some work on it but um yeah it is what it is you know and um boy it's got some dirty gunk in there too it's it's filthy inside Ooh. But anyways, we'll just let it sink in there, enjoy its bath for tonight, and um, I don't know if I'm going to get any more results than what I've got already. Uh, we could put, we'll put one more tablet in to each one, but I think we're, we're at our limit to what we're going to get from, from th these legs here. But it did lighten up in areas, which is great, you know, so... Um, I'm happy on that part of it, but I was really hoping like what I got from the arms itself and I just that it's just not happening I mean, yeah, the the dark areas are lighter, but I was hoping for more But let's see what happens overnight, you know, um, I could get a little bit better results and um, We'll just let it be at that and um, Let's see what happens and if not we'll do the the pimple cream and um, heat it up and just wrap up the legs and see what we get from that way too. If we can lighten it up, all the better. Which, th what is this telling me though? Well, it's, I'm really looking at the Ricky's head. It's really bad. So if the legs, which are worse than the arms, this is the results I'm getting. I might be able to light, lighten up Ricky's head and body a bit more by doing this, which is fine. I'm okay with that doing that but um, I will probably have to still do the pimple cream I can see that happening and um, I might look at buying that peroxide that the gentleman on doe deer wonderland I think it's called he um, used that and I think that might be something I might look at getting and trying that out as well but um, the peroxide does work when it comes to um, you know that like in the pimple cream it does work but we'll just see um i got some water spilt over here too i can see that <clears throat> yeah so the thing is is that we just got to keep trying you know i don't want to give up on on uh this here i really would like to see it lighten up as much as i i can get this because this is this is nice this is really working out really nice so in in its own way uh, the arms were did wonderful but i'm just not sure how the body's going to do and the head and i got to look for a container to put the head in and the body i do have an i i do have an idea but it's, the, the only problem is going to be we won't be able to see through it's um it's not see through so i might find something here that i can use and so i can put the body into it so we'll, i'm going to keep looking i was looking at maybe emptying out a couple of these tubs up here right there and just using those for the time being and then I can put everything back in it afterwards it won't hurt it or anything just make it smell good the polydent so I might just do that I have one here I can empty out I'll find I won't use these ones up here I have some underneath my bench here so I can probably use them and um, might be able to put the sink the body into that I don't know about the head though if the head will I laid the head down can I cover it that's what I'm looking at so the body for sure I can put the body in it's the head that I'm concerned over it might work we'll see 
But anyways, um, I was concerned also with the tube that's inside, but then I thought, I don't put water in this doll anymore. So if he doesn't have his tube in the end, I really am okay with it, you know, because all my Ricky's going to do is just sit. So I think I'll be fine with that, with uh, taking off his head and um, taking out his eyes and um, soaking his head and taking out the tube if I have to. Maybe I can leave the tube in. Maybe it won't do anything. I'm not going to try to remove the tube. So if the tube will stay in, if it stays in through pulling off the head, I'm fine with that. So not, not a problem there for me. But anyways, we'll take that up when it comes, when the time comes. I am not ready for that yet. I want to work on these legs and um, see how that works out. But um, like I said, I'm not thrilled with my results. They're just not where it's heading to. Like I was really hoping those dark spots would be a lot, lot less. But by morning they could be. So... I'm not going to get upset yet. and um, But anyways, there we go. I hope you enjoyed the videos. And I got more coming about this experiment. I'm loving it. You know, so anyways, I'm going to go back now and work on my F&B dolls for about an hour. And then I think I'll go to bed. So everybody, everybody oh, I'll upload these and then go to bed. So have a good night, everybody. And I'm coming back with more tomorrow. Bye-bye.